What is up guys and gals? Welcome to one of the smartphones tutorial videos on the Google Pixel 3. In this video, I'll be going over the security on the Google Pixel 3 and the different types of passwords that you can set. So the first thing that I'm gonna demonstrate here is the type of security that I have on it now is the password or the security called swipe. Um, so if your device is off and you turn it on just by hitting the power button, you have to swipe up to open it up. There is no real security. It's just more of like a pocket security. So you don't accidentally open your device and phone dial somebody. Um, and if you wanted to change that, that's kind of what comes stock on the device. If you want to change it, we're going to go into settings by sliding up. And if you slide up the long, the full uh, amount, you will see a screen similar to this. You should be able to find a settings little um, gear that looks like that. So go ahead and select settings. From here, we're going to want to go and scroll down into security and location. And a little ways down, we will see the device security being this, uh, the screen lock is through the swipe. Um, there is an option called none, and that means there is no security at all. So um, I turn my device, powered it, um, powered the screen off. If I just hit the power button, it takes me right back to where I left off. And this is where the pocket dials and stuff happen with um, security like this. It could also happen with the swipe one, but not as, um, not as likely as with this one. This is just for the lock screen um, with no security. Um, so the swipe is one that we had where if you set it to swipe and you power your screen off and turn it on, there's that lock screen between. You just swipe it um, to get it out of there. The next one we have is a pattern. Um, so for the pattern, let's say we do a Z. We're going to hit next. It's going to want a confirmation verification. We'll go ahead and confirm. And here it's asking us what type of um, information do you want on your notification screen when you get receive a text message, a call. Um, show all the notification content, hide sensitive content, and don't show any at all. So you can select whichever one you want and then hit done. Um, so the pattern one is now active. As we see, it's been changed here. If you hit the power button and you go to powered on, you have, for, you have to do the swipe to get it to the lock screen. And you put in the password or the swipe that you put in, the swipe pattern that you put in. Um, so if you wanted to change that, you're going to have to verify your password or your swipe um, and then there's the pin option go ahead and select that let's just do one two three four don't use this password it's very bad and easy just as bad as one 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 um, it's something that everybody always tries so one two three four it's asking us to re-enter the pin and once we have that confirmed the pin is set as our type um, so let's just go ahead and hit the power button once again swipe up and we are at the pin one two three four is what we set hit the check mark and it'll take you right in there. Um, so going back to um, the last option, we will go down into um, the security and location. And from here, right in the middle, screen lock type we have set as pin. It's gonna be asked to verify the pin one more time um, just because you are looking to change it. So just so if somebody doesn't know your actual pin, they won't be able to change it. Um, and then password is the last one. Um, here, it's at least four characters, so you can type whatever you want. I'm just going to go ahead and use cars. That's short and easy for demonstration purposes. I would recommend something longer and a little um, harder for other people to hack. So just like that, we have set it to the password type as a written text. Just like that, you swipe up to your lock screen, and you're going to have to type your password in, cars, hit your the check mark, and just like that, it will lock you lock your device not letting anybody else um, access any of your information so that is how to activate and turn your password on and off on the google pixel 3. if you guys found this video helpful go ahead give it a thumbs up if you guys have any other comments questions or concerns go ahead drop those in the comment section below if you guys found this video helpful once again give it a thumbs up and if you guys like to check out other helpful tips and tricks on the google pixel check out that playlist in the description below that's all i got for you guys in this one thanks for watching have a nice day